Le premier joueur à entrer sur le cours n'a que 20 ans. Ce sont ses premiers internationaux de France. Il est autrichien Dominique Tim. Et il s'est imposé à celui qui l'a emporté ici par 8 fois, l'Espagnol Rafael Navarre. What struck you most when you walked out on the court for the match? What, what impressed you the most? Until uh, today, I think the most was uh, in Vienna. The crowd was 7,000, 8,000. It's, it's still a lot of more people uh, here in Paris. So uh, it was a quite big thing to walk out. What was the plan? It's tough to make a plan against him here in Paris. Uh, already many players uh, wanted to make a plan. <laughs> and then they didn't make it. But uh, of course, I had a plan. I don't want to tell it here. <laughs> a lot of players say that playing Rafa at Roland Garros on court Philippe Chatrier is maybe the biggest challenge in tennis. I think it's not only in tennis the biggest challenge, it's uh, even in world sports the biggest challenge. Yeah. Because simply the fact that he won it uh, eight times. I was thinking about it, it's, it's just amazing to lose only one match and win 62. I didn't think about it before, but uh, I think these are, these are the effects and uh, of course he has a lot of self-confidence. He's, he's the king of clay. Despite the loss, did you enjoy yourself? You have to enjoy yourself if you play on this court. The fact that it's my first year on the ATP Tour, uh, it's my first Roland Garros. Uh, only because of this, I had to enjoy every moment and I'm quite happy about it. Yeah. So you lost the one match, now you can win 62 next matches you play here? Uh, Of course, yeah. I have almost 28. Djokovic and Dandy has 27. Federer has, I don't know, 32. The new generation, new, new players have to come. And we're not going to be here for 10 more years. So the normal thing is Dominic will be there in a short period of time and he will have his chances to become top star and fight for, for this tournament.